Hello everyone, and welcome back to Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. It's been a little while since I played this game, but it should be pretty obvious why I'm back at this point. Yes, Banjo and Kazooie have joined the game, and it is time for us to check it out. Yes, version 5.0.0. A lot of stuff is going on. I have missed a lot of stuff. Alright, we finally made it to the game. Alright, so... What are we going to do? Classic mode, obviously. That's how we handle the new characters. They've also revealed the next um, character that's coming. It's a character from SNK. I don't know him, so, you know. Not super excited, but uh, we will still check it out when it comes. They've also confirmed their, that the DLC will continue after the fighter pass ends. Alright, so we've got the other duo here. The other classic animal duo. Get it. Okay, I need to figure out all. Okay. Here are my eggs. Wait, we actually get Pokeballs? I want that. How do I stop shooting? Oh, good. That was worth the effort. Ow. Oh, I definitely want to see what my final smash is. Dang it. What is this dog doing? Nice. Well, that was easy. Dog wasn't trying very much. I won't complain. Intensity moving forward. Alright, another duo. I'm sensing a theme. Are we going to get the Ice Climbers too? They're less of a iconic duo, I guess, because... Okay, really? Luma just died? Nice, I like the throw. Okay, that was... Nice. With golden feathers. Alright, what else we got? What else? Luma died again. Oh, we got grenades. Okay. I didn't expect to see those, really. I'm trying to think of what all the moves I've tried are. Ah, uh, the Banjo Kazooie music. So classic. Wow. I barely clipped her hair and she just died. Difficulty intenses. Yep, called it. Are we going to get Pokemon Trainer 2 then? Or is that not count enough anymore? I don't know. Okay, ow. Oh good, thank you Windows. I don't know if you guys heard that, but Windows is annoying me about an update for my mouse. Because, you know, I really care about updating my mouse's software every single day. Okay, yep, we're falling. You know what? Just take that to the face, please. You know what? Get out of here. Oh, that was easy. Nice. A lot of score gained. And up we go. Point six this time. We should actually be getting to difficult ones. Ah, Link and Zelda. So now we're switching to multi-character duos. Does that mean we're going to get Mario and Luigi or Mario and Peach, I wonder? I mean, obviously we got to get Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong, right? Or something along that line. Just because of Rare. That has to be one of them. Maybe the last one, even. I gotta say, the AI is not really putting up much of a fight. Um. Yep, goodbye. I expected a little more difficulty, especially after not playing this game for so many months. Fox and Falco. Okay, I didn't see that one coming. 
But I mean, I guess they don't have crystals, so they can't really do that combo. Also, Fox looks a little weird. Oh my gosh, get out of here. Wow, so easy. I mean, I am very damaged. Whoops, sorry. Not sorry. Only 68k points for that, come on. It was easy. Get all the points. All right, 7.4. Getting intense in here. There we go. Not the final battle, though. Very interesting. Ow. Did he get out of here? What is this? I have no idea what this is. How did it even get here? I don't know. I must have done it on accident. I have no idea. Oh, no. No! Why can't I not jump? For some reason, I couldn't jump. Oh well. What did I do wrong? I can jump in the air. I don't know why I couldn't jump. I did something wrong. But I do not know what. Okay, well that's problematic. What even was that? Didn't do much. Come on, jump into my bombs. Uh oh. Really? What is with the sudden difficulty spike? Get out of here. Got whatever this thing is. Looks like it's a healing field. I do hate how spirit mode made me unaware of items. Yeah, not surprised we didn't get many points for that one. That sucked. Now we have to gradually rise up higher on our points. Perfect partners. You look so happy. Okay. His jumps are not quite as good as I had hoped, I think. And that's what's getting me. Just not very mobile. Do we have Talon Trot, I wonder? Yeah, we do. It's just kind of hard to chain it together as a high speed thing. Yeah, see, that's not easy to climb the stairs as him for me. I do enjoy the spring pad that appears when you jump. Oh well, we made it through. We got a decent amount of points. At least compared to the fights. Alright. Ah, Master Hand and Crazy Hand. Yeah, that makes sense. That is definitely a duo. Alright. Okay, so the spring pad does hurt. That's good to know. Very good to know. What is he doing? I thought he was gonna like do the grab or something. Okay, yep, he got me. Oh no. Oh no. Get me out of here. Oh my gosh, Banjo. Banjo, why? Okay, I don't even know what this is, but it looked painful. Come on, Kazooie, you do all the work. Dang it, I tried to shield, but I was too slow. Oh, well, we got, almost got him. Okay, fire. 
That's also not a move I'm very familiar with. Oh crap, I can't jump. No. I should have used my um, golden feathers to move to the side earlier. Oh well. Got a less intense fight now. I'm not very good with this duo. Okay, you know what? Come on. We can get crazy hand down. Okay, yep, that hurt. Just die. If I can just kill one of them, then I can easily kill the other. And I'm so close to killing them. Ow. What? No, I didn't mean to do that. Stupid. The analog stick gets me more than anything else, I think. I try to press one thing, and I end up doing another. I don't know if it's the analog stick drift or something. I have no idea, really. I don't remember having that big of an issue back on the GameCube. Maybe I should use a GameCube controller. Alright. Well, that kind of was terrible, but we did it in the end. I do like his classic mode, though. It's a decent setup. Nice yeah. I don't say it would be nice work. It was reasonable work. Now what? There we go. Okay, how do we speed this up again? Which button? There we go. Classic banjo music. I'm just gonna shoot around even though there's nothing happening. Oh yeah, look at all those rare characters plus other random characters for some reason. Like, why is Kirby there? Why is Link there? Why is the villager there? Nobody knows. Uh, X for next. Got it. Alright. Got a fighter spirit. We got whatever that is. Got a whole bunch of that. What did it say about the fighter spirit? I can't go over and look. Oh well. Oh, I could have pressed X, apparently. I saw that right as I pressed start. Alright, well yeah, that is a Banjo and Kazooie there. We definitely accomplished a thing. So once you beat it, can you do it again but harder? I think that's how it works. No, you're still limited to starting at 5 no matter what. Okay, well, that's fine. I wasn't planning on doing it again right now anyway. But I definitely do want to get better with Banjo and Kazooie. I think they're a decent character, it's just tough for me to learn a new character on the spot like that. While also commentating and trying to focus on things. But yeah, I'm definitely very, very happy to finally see Banjo and Kazooie back in the rightful place on a Nintendo console. And in a game that actually exists in the modern day instead of, you know, nothing since Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, which is quite a while ago now. But yeah, hopefully this helps revive the characters and maybe they'll get another decent game under their belts at some point in the near future. Especially, you know, with all the HD re-releases and stuff lately, I would love to see a Banjo and Kazooie HD re-release that then also leads into 3E. But, uh, who knows? Probably won't happen. But yeah, anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!